What's up, everybody? It's the homie Troop Teller, the street reporter. And a lot of people be asking me about the GDs and why the GD rappers from Chicago didn't get on. Um, to be honest, uh, it was some blackballing shit going on. You got to understand when it's a war, it's two sides beefing against each other. One side got rich, the BDs, okay? They entered the rap game first. They befriended people who are gatekeepers, you know, they cool with the complexes, the breakfast clubs, the radio stations, the A&Rs, club promoters, producers, label owners, Chief Keith and Lil Durk and them and King Von, know all of them, so it was hard for the GD rappers to get on once they got the buzz and shit like that. And to be honest, you know, I think the GD rappers seen a lot of what Chief Keep did and they did the same thing just like a lot of his friends and the BD rappers did. But I think the GDs kind of was a little too, too violent. Don't get me wrong. You do see videos of both sides kind of um, entangling in the beef and the smoking dead homies and the disrespect. But... The GD rappers kind of took it to a level that was extreme, I guess, because Chief Keep got on off extremeness. I think they thought if they was extra extreme, it'd get to that point, you know, but I don't think it did. They actually had a chance when uh, Famous Dex ended up getting a rap deal and blowing up and shit like that. Um, but Famous Dex wasn't really on no gang gang shit. He kind of blew up and did his own thing and that's the reason why i think he fell off too besides the drugs and rich the kid playing him out his contract he left everybody who was a part of his movement you no longer see the famous urge you no longer see the flash shines and shit like that that's what people was used to so dex kind of went to california and got him a new set of homies kind of slowed him down a lot of people thought dex was the gd hope we thought dex was gonna do for the gds the same thing that chief keep did for the bds when he opened up the door a lot of them got on besides famous dex he the only one got on you know duck is just now getting to the point where he was climbing up um i'm not sure uh, if they ever have a chance to get on but it's a possibility because it is guys so i think um got the possibility to do it i think people like um i don't want to name no names to get to getting into that shit but i do think it's a possibility but in my opinion the reason the gd rappers didn't get on is because they enemies got on first and then you know they tried to do the same thing that the bds did but you know i know this might sound sinister and crazy but when the bds was dissing the gd dead homies and shit people was rapping that shit and going along with that shit because we didn't really know the gds but when the GDs dissed the BDs dead people, a lot of people took that shit to heart because they know about the ODs, they know about the new news, they know about the J Moneys, they know about the T Roy. So, you know, people kind of blackballed the GD rappers and made it seem like they just super violent on some bullshit and untalented. But in reality, they really just take enough for their own. You know, Chief Keep made Smoking Tuka famous. So Duck tried to make Smoking T Roy famous, you know? I know this shit sounds sinister, but that's what happened. But in my opinion, you know, Famous Dex could have helped the GD rappers get on. But in my opinion, they were blackballed by the BDs. They got on first. They got rich and famous and powerful. And shit, it happened like that. Just imagine you in a war with a motherfucker, right? Imagine you in a war, bro. Like, this is the craziest shit that can happen. Imagine you in a full-fledged, bloody war. And then you wake up the next morning and your enemy get rich. And we seen that happen to FBG, you know, that's part of the reasons why they whole crew got wiped out. But hey, I'ma leave a um I'ma leave a comment, man, in the comment section that got my Instagram on there. I want all y'all to follow me on Instagram. Leave a like on this video, cause when you leave a like on this video, it make it grow and a lot of people be able to see it. So I appreciate it. It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. Blah, blah, blah.